eight days, more than 700 kilometers in distance and 15,000 meters of climbing through rugged terrain in South Africa's Western Cape region. Welcome to the Absa Cape Epic, the Tour de France of mountain biking and arguably one of the world's toughest mountain bike stage races. The story of the race is closely linked with that of Team Bulls, a German race outfit that started seven years ago with Karl Platt and Stefan Saab and has left their mark on the Absa Cape Epic like no other team. In this episode, we take a look back at the early days of the Bulls. Yeah, the Absa Cape Epic was the first big thing for us together as a, as a team. And um, yeah, 2007 was very special. We were the underdogs and nobody uh, counted on us really, so it was a fantastic year. We came here to race without big expectations that hey, if, if we make it top five, that would be awesome. That brought the team together. And since then, yeah, I mean, that, that year was just perfect. Cape Epic directly, the, the overall victory, the un, unestimated victory, had like directly brought the team to the top and in everybody's mouth. 2009. That cost me maybe some years of my life. <laughs> I had some major issues with my shoulder and then in the prologue, kilometer before the finish line, I hit a stone, boom, shoulder dislocated. Pop it in, got on the bike, finished uh, the race, finished like, I don't know, 14, 15 position. And I thought, okay, the race is over. So yeah, we decided to race because yeah, we were there. Yeah, we tried, why not? And then on the second day, we finished second. And then uh, we finished again in front. And then we got the yellow jersey, won the stage. And then from then on, it was just suffering because the shoulder was so loose. It was a crazy epic. We went through so many emotions. And then crossing the finish line in Lawrence Ford with the yellow jersey and knowing that we have won it again, it was uh, yeah, something really special. The uh, Epic 2010 was for me probably the easiest Epic ever because I was in such a good shape. There was never a stage where I had problems. Even on the last stage, Stefan bended his chain. We stopped and we changed the chain within under one minute. We stopped on uh, the Epic. We were yeah, like a perfect combination. Could think what the other guy is, is thinking or how he would react in a certain race situation. And we were not talking a lot on the bike. We, we just knew what, uh, what the other was, uh, was thinking. So we were always like in an in a underdog position. And uh, to prove that we are maybe at that point the best stage racing team was very cool. For sure the three victories stand out of, of everything because there's so much uh, preparation and so much effort and training and blood, sweat and tears going into that and suffering the whole week in the maybe the nicest country but in the in the worst conditions for mountain biking that you that you can imagine that makes it so tough and, and stand out from from everything. That week of racing in the Epic is something very very special. It's a lifetime experience, so you forget so many moments in your life, but uh, the week of racing in Epic, you never forget because it's so much excitement and pain, and sometimes you think, why I'm doing that shit? Yeah. 